For those of you who are not woke, I need to tell you about A Little Late with Lily Singh. And woke is a joke here, but not in any sense of the word being funny. She's the first non-white, bisexual female Canadian late night TV host. And she's gonna remind you about that. I'm more than just a bisexual woman of color, okay? Look, I get it, okay? I'm not your traditional talk show host. I mean, the media has mentioned I'm a bisexual woman of color. She replaced Last Call with Carson Daly's time slot when it ended after 2,000 episodes. While I need to warn you, you can catch her show on NBC in the US and on global TV in Canada. And you can bet Canada is not proud of how she's ruining the great comedy tradition of the Great White North. Good day, welcome to the Great White North, uh, Canadian Corner. Even Canadian bisexual vegans are picking up their hunting rifles when this show airs. It's that bad. She's so woke that even coffee cringes in the morning when she's mentioned. Her comedic attacks on white people, American culture, and straight people might be overlooked if it were in fact funny. But it's more of a cringe fest of bad social justice warrior themes fused with very bad writing and a fake laugh track. Hello, my name is Lily and I ain't a white man. What's up? My skin got some color and it ain't a spray tan. She attacks white people but forgets that white people made laws to allow her family to move to Canada and white people even hired her at NBC. And she's not a poor minority either. She has made millions on YouTube already. Johnny Carson himself would roll over in his grave for what NBC is doing to the tradition of comedy and late night with this lady. Here's Johnny! I am embarrassed for Canada for how poor this show is and Lord knows I've given her many chances. I love late night TV even when it's mediocre as sometimes there's that good laugh or two. Lily Singh can't even deliver one solid chuckle in her 30 minute show. It's that tragic. Here's a penis! Just take a look at some of the headlines alone from the IMDB reviews of her show on A Little Late with Lily Singh. This comparison to Hitler is one of the more kind references I could actually find. But I have some great news and a prediction. A little late with Lily Singh will probably be cancelled and we will all be spared the torture. How do I know this? The website One Iota that offers free tickets to her show tapings are no longer offering tickets. That and NBC has not publicly stated that the show will be renewed for a second season makes me fairly confident that this show is headed for the same place that the Pat Sajak show went. Loser! Are you woke enough for Lily Singh for a second season? I doubt it. Post your comments below. Okay, that's our show for day. Good day. I think that was like our best show ever. You know, I was thinking I could actually share my perspective, especially being a woman and all.